Hey, this is Tom, and we're going to talk about loading film onto a development reel. In the Ilford video, they call these spirals, but it's a, it's a development reel here in America. Okay, now this is like the, the practice film that you'll be given. This is the end, um, the end of the roll. This came from a actual canister. Here's the thing, most important thing, that when you go in, you wanna set things up and you wanna set the reel down in a way that when you pick it up in the total darkness, these ball bearings are away from you because you have to slide this film in and pull it. You wanna It uses the ball bearings to catch, all right? Let me now I took the reel apart just by going backwards. This takes it apart. That puts it together. These are even and the ball bearings are there, okay? So the thing that you wanna watch for is that when you pull this forward, you can only go so far and then there you go. Piece of cake. The plastic reels make it a little easier. Most important thing, I can't say it enough, ball bearings are away from you. You'll then take this, put it on this stem. If you're only processing one reel, you're always gonna have the other reel on top. And then they just go in the tank like that, and the tank goes on top, tightens down, and now it's light tight. Now with this on, you can turn the lights on and start processing your film. Okay, so there's uh, loading film to a reel. All right, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. I'm always happy to help. Thanks.